Welcome. It is 5 p.m. in South Africa, Johannesburg. Good evening, good morning, good afternoon, wherever you are in the world. Pleased to have you here. This is the second episode of my Bounce Back series. Today we're going to look at a few definitions. Nelson Mandela said, Do not judge me by my success. Judge me by how many times I fell down and got up again. I say, Judge me by my grit and resilience and how many times I bounce back from adversity or disappointment. Grit is my drive, my passion, my perseverance and my persistence that keeps me interested and focused on my goals and aspirations. Resilience is my optimism that gets me to bounce back, working with renewed energy and greater strength and determination after facing a difficult challenge. Hi everyone, I'm Lois Wagner from Coaching Conversations for Change. I'm developing this series on what is resilience, bouncing back, and I'm going to be delivering a, a short video three times a week, Mondays, Wednesdays, and Fridays. And I'd love you all to participate, to contribute, to ask questions, and get involved. So what is grit and resilience? Grit really is that self-control, that perseverance, it makes you stick to something, makes you set your goals and work conscientiously towards achieving those goals. It, 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 regardless of the setbacks or the roadblocks, you keep focused and you keep going after your goal. Resilience is how you bounce back and how you recover after hitting one of those roadblocks or those setbacks setbacks. It's how you overcome those struggles, those difficult circumstances that we all face at some point during projects or in life and in our careers. A lot of words you hear spoken and bandied about grit, resilience, bouncing back. What is bouncing back? Bouncing back really is where you don't wallow in self-pity. Oh, woe is me. I never achieved this, I never got that finished, this happened to me, that person did the other to me. And instead of sitting in that self-pity, it's about working through the disappointment, the, de the defeat, the adversity, the trauma, the tragedy, the threats, the failures. And it's facing whatever those challenges and setbacks are with strength, determination, optimis optimism and positivity. You also often hear the term mental toughness or mental endurance. And basically what that is, it just means that you have the grit and resilience to work through. It, but it also includes that you see every opportunity as a learning opportunity. Every struggle, every challenge as a learning opportunity. And that you take whatever comes at you, you take it in your stride and you keep on going. Fortitude is another word that is often spoken about, and that's very similar. It really refers to your inner or your innate strength. And then we talk about a growth mindset. What is a growth mindset, and how do we get a growth mindset? Some people say it's hard work, could be smart work, plus it's your innate strength or your innate talent. So it's what you learn, develop, work at and what you are born, born with. Our intelligence, our talents, our abilities and our skills can be developed with the right amount of determination, information and support. People with a growth mindset believe that they can get smarter, they believe they can get better and more skilled as long as they put in some sustained effort and that they have that support. They put a lot of energy into lifelong learning. They look for learning opportunities. They see setbacks as learning opportunities. And they explore their everyday environment. What is new? What can I learn? How can I incorporate this into my life? How can I make this a learning situation? 
Whereas people who've got a fixed mindset believe that you are born with what you are born with and those innate abilities are, are all you'll ever have. You either have it or you don't have it. So what do you believe? Do you believe that you've got a growth mindset or do you have a fixed mindset? Do you have resilience and grit? Do you bounce back? Please keep following me. Join me on this journey. On Monday, we'll be looking at some of the characteristics. What makes up the, the personality or the traits of somebody who has grit and resilience? Thank you very much for watching and please do participate, ask questions, whether you're watching this live or whether you're watching it on the replay. I would love to have your input. Have a fantastic weekend and I'll see you all on Monday. Thank you. Hi Caroline, <laughs> I've just seen you've popped on. Thank you for watching and we'll see you all on Monday. Bye.